Hello, royal folks. It's good to see you all here again. This is your regular dose of royal news and analysis. But before we start, please subscribe to my channel and click the bell icon. Thanks. The Prince and Princess of Wales have cultivated an incredible team around them, a trusted entourage to help advise and organize their busy schedules. One of their most trusted members is Hannah Cockburn Logie, often referred to as Kate's right-hand woman. But it seems Hannah has now taken a step back from some of her royal responsibilities. According to information from Company's House, Hannah is no longer working as a director of the Royal Foundation of the Prince and Princess of Wales. Paperwork confirms the termination of her role from 31 October 2022. Hannah took on the role of director in July 2020. She was also appointed as the princess's new private secretary, taking on responsibility for organizing Kate's diary and meetings, as well as accompanying her on engagements. Prior to that, she had established a relationship with the royal couple when she accompanied them on their seven-day tour to India and Putin in April 2016. As Kate's private secretary, Hannah remains an integral member of the Princess A team. Others on that list include royal nanny Maria Teresa Turian Borello, who cares for their three children, Prince George, Princess Charlotte, and Prince Louis. E. She was employed by Kate in 2014 when George was just eight months old, having graduated from Bath's prestigious Norland College. She is often seen by the children's side wearing her distinctive Norland uniform, a brown dress with white gloves and a brown hat. Natasha Archer, or Tash as she is fondly called in royal circles, is the creative brain behind the Duchess chic and impeccable style. She was appointed Kate's stylist shortly after the royal announced her second pregnancy, and since then, Tash has been upping the it factor of Kate's wardrobe. She has encouraged the Duchess to experiment a bit more with her outfits, while also ensuring that Kate holds tight to her style icon status. Manda Cook Tucker, meanwhile, is the lady behind Kate's luscious locks. She is said to have a close bond with Kate, with reports that she was among the very first people to meet Prince George when he was born. What's more, she has a long-standing relationship with the royals. Amanda cut Prince William and Prince Harry's hair when they were children, which suggests she probably tends to George, Charlotte, and Lou E. too. So what do you think, guys? Please share your thoughts in the comments. Until then, thanks for watching. We'll see you again with some more interesting news about royal family. Thank you.